Today, we're gonna talk about inflammation and weight gain. Lately, a question has been going around, which one comes first, inflammation or weight gain? Kind of like the chicken or the egg. Well, before we get into it, let me tell you that there are two types of inflammation, acute inflammation and chronic inflammation. Acute inflammation is a good thing. For example, a mosquito bite comes, bites you, that area turns a little red. That actually means your immune system is at work and is healing you, but it goes away. But chronic inflammation is a completely different story. Chronic inflammation never shuts off. It's like your immune system is turned on 24 seven. This is due to your visceral fat creating inflammatory chemicals that causes chronic diseases over time, like diabetes type two, heart disease, some cancers, depression, among others. So now scientists are telling us that inflammation may contribute to weight gain by disrupting the balance of hormones that control your appetite and metabolism. Hormones like ghrelin and leptin that play a role in controlling your hunger and fullness, if they get out of whack, they might contribute to you overeating and gaining weight. Also, some studies suggest the potential link between inflammation and insulin resistance. And let me tell you, insulin resistance makes weight loss very hard. Insulin resistance has to do with glucose metabolism. Watch my video about insulin resistance here in my channel. You will have a great understanding of insulin resistance. So scientists are telling us that inflammation may contribute to weight gain. But now let's flip the coin. How about weight gain and poor diet creating inflammation? That's what I've known for years. So poor diet and weight gain can lead to excess visceral fat what causes inflammation. Visceral fat is the type of fat that surrounds your organs. This type of fat increases in size when someone gains weight. It's the size of the visceral fat, the problem. Once it gets to get too large, it starts producing inflammatory chemicals and that causes chronic inflammation. And now chronic inflammation may lead to more weight gain. To me, this sounds like a vicious cycle. So it is also important to know that everyone is different and everyone gains weight differently. Some people may gain weight in their buttocks or maybe they have more subcutaneous fat. That kind of fat does not cause chronic inflammation. Again, it's visceral fat. Or some people may not be overweight at all and eating a bad diet. You know, high sugar, saturated fat, fried foods, processed foods, you name it those people also are at risk of inflammation. So which one comes first, inflammation or weight gain? The answer isn't black and white. It's more complex than that. I think this is a vicious cycle and trust me, you want to get out of this cycle now. So how do you know you have excess visceral fat? Well, let me tell you, it's an easy test. Just grab a tape like this and take a measurement of your waistline. Women with more than 35 inches and men with more than 40 inches are at risk of chronic inflammation. But I have good news for you. You can schedule a 20 minute free discovery call with me and I can help you lose that belly fat. Make an appointment on my website, manuelviacorta.com, free discovery call for 20 minutes and I can hear your goals and I can tell you how I can help you to fight or reduce inflammation. You wanna follow these steps. You gotta live a healthy lifestyle with good nutrition, including anti-inflammatory foods, like anti-inflammatory fats, omega-3, monounsaturated fats like in avocados and olive oil, nuts and seeds. You also wanna eat whole grains. You want to make sure you eat foods with probiotics and plenty of fruits and vegetables. Now, you wanna exercise and make sure to do stress management. I hope you have learned something today and remember, you can always go to my website for more information about inflammation. I have books, articles, videos, recipes, you name it, manuelvillacorta.com. And remember, you can schedule your free 20 minute consultation, or now I am offering a monthly webinar that you can sign up for free. So check it out, manuelvillacorta.com.